Maybe you'll come back to the original randomized everything. Um, stuff has been reset. And we got a new ship. One that is uh, omitted from the regular BIOS fleet mod because it doesn't play nice with them. Yep, we're gonna do another run. It's probably gonna be a short one with the masochist. <laughs> yep. The masochist. I believe this was the last ship I ever made. And it's a doozy. And the name isn't a lie. It doesn't start... Well, it starts with shields, but it starts with crummy shields. It starts with a single shot crystal thingy, so it can at least do some uh, plinking damage. But the augments is where it all comes together, doesn't it? First of all, we have the crystal retribution. An optimized form of the crystal vengeance. This one is guaranteed to break off a shard. So it's basically crystal vengeance with 100% chance to fire stuff at the enemy if they hit you. And then crystal regrowth. Special crystals grow to patch up the hole, utilizing debris unfit for regular scrap purposes, which is basically a scrap arm that does not take away scrap. A rough start, but if you can pull through, this thing is uh, pretty darn good. I'm not sure if the um, augments will work at the start of sectors, but uh, we'll see soon enough, I guess. Names are the same, just, well, the names. The blueprint names are the same, so I think they'll work. I'm not sure what Crystal Vengeance actually gives you, though. Oh, right, you can make a drone. Ooh, crystal drone. Ooh. Um, all right. Let's get murdered. I have to remind myself that we do have a med bay, not a clone bay. I was also looking, I do remember this one when I was actually trying to make this ship, if there was a way to increase the damage these um, Crystal Vengeance shards do. And whilst there is a blueprint for them, you can't actually change them. Well, you can change them, but it doesn't work. Sad, but... Oh, you're just trying to run, that's annoying. We'll try to stop it, but... Okay, that's like the second shot or something that you took. Try to survive. Yep, he's running. Well, you know the drill. If the first one goes horribly wrong, we're free to restart. Hey, a good start is everything, right? So if the run starts bad, like really, really start, and then, uh, we can do this. Pew pew. Oh no, my shields are hacked. Oh my god. This would be a really bad start for uh, a lot of ships. Like the first event, they already lose your shields. Ugh. This one doesn't care one bit. It would be nice if you could actually hit the ship every now and then, though. Not gonna lie. found the way to beat me. So yeah, we get 18 scrap, we will get 18, and we'll also get a little bit of hull. See? Works like a charm. 
Considering the ship is going to be taking quite a hefty beating at the start of uh, these runs, it's probably worth it. Um, wish I could, but I don't have anything. Attack the slaver scum. And there we go. That's all we need to do from an offensive standpoint. Now we just need to repair stuff as it breaks. The enemy is tearing itself apart. Okay, you go fix, you go fix. Oh, that's on fire. That's less than ideal. Again? Oh, restream. I do apologize for that. Let me see. Yeah. <sighs> Could you just reconnect for me? It's gonna poop them all out in chat soon, I think. Or yeah, there you go. Blop 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 blop. Uh, uh sure. Um yeah, it's poor ship lacking powerful or reliable weapons. That is completely correct. But again, it has the um, free repair arm repairs, and it has um, crystal vengeance as f is guaranteed to fire every time. Whether it's going to hit every time, a different question altogether. But So yeah, you meant your mental hobble through the first few sectors, and after that, the party can begin. Attack the Marauders! And no, we're not going to send crew in afterwards because there's a small chance you lose crew. Which, if you're me, that means you're going to lose crew. <laughs> and it's probably going to take one of my uh, crystals. I don't like my crystals. I'd like to keep them. Look at me. I need to get my mini-beam fixed. I am so important. Worth it. Probably not, though. It was not. Yeah, anything will do. We do need something with more than one shot, otherwise it's kind of pointless. This really is just the ship you'd play for fun. <laughs> Look, Captain, we fired upon the enemy ship. What the heck is he doing now? Why are so many bullets coming my way? Help. Oh, uh, loving it. I don't think this has a chance to breach. Oh, it does have a chance to breach. If it breaches, which is a very slim than a chance then no no not gonna get a crew kill on this one vaccination for a local plague yeah they always make you feel bad for that one I mean, the same thing could be said of the Carnelian. It starts started with a clone way as well. 
The moment you see crystals, your mind should immediately go like, ding, boarding. Sitting on the sound. He can die from this, right? Nope, he can't die, but he can. Uh, right, he can't die, but it's not a guaranteed success. It basically takes away that potential. I should not fix that, because in case that starts a fire, it could cause whole damage. Okay, so we need to get to 100 to get our first level of shields up. Now the even better part is if we do not get a weapon before enemy ships start having two shield layers, we're basically stuck taking hits. <laughs> so that's gonna be fun. Here to here, here to here. Yeah, we can get through still, right? Here to here, here to here, yeah. Look at me, I got a missile launcher. I'll get through your shields. No, there's no shields for you to get through, so. Fire the missiles. Well, they're not missiles, but they may as well be. Go, repair Mantis. You've got this. That's unfortunate. Well, these guys are gonna run. Not the bravest type. Let's try it. See? It's a small chance that that happens. Bam! Every time I've tried it, I've lost a crew member. Uh, I love showing the audience wrong. They don't believe I got worse luck than anybody else, so. Never get the opportunity to. I occasionally do like to try that. It does the job. But again, I don't think we're actually gonna succeed in this run. It's the main reason I decided to start up another one, because half the time this ship is just going to fail. It stands a better chance in um, not Arsenal or Captain's Edition or whatever. Yeah, probably will be. But we'll have fun, right? You know, we're causing breaches left, right and center on the enemy ship. Good lord, they're not having fun. Hey, stop that. Come on, breach. Aww. Well, if you got the breach, we would have had a crew kill, but nope. Well, it depends, actually. Oh, is he, he's going to be able to repair that, right? It's a mantis trying to repair it. He's still going to make it, right? Mantis is slow, but he's not that slow. Yeah. Hey, the run lives. <laughs> Again, though, keep in mind if you can't get another weapon soon, we're pretty pretty much done. Dead in the water. Stuck, having to get hit by. Um, Ah, drones. Another thing the ship isn't really uh, good for, shall we say. At least we took their shields down, that's gonna help a ton. <laughs> it 
We may have celebrated a little too soon, lads. Well, we got the drone. I think doors would help. I'm gonna lose the... Well, oh, it doesn't fire out a crystal shard. That's unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. And how. You're... F Fairly healthy. Man, that. Yes, we won. Now we just need to live. How hard can that be, right? See, we're fine-ish. Is YouTube still busted? Or busted again? Mm, nope, apparently not. Well, sure. Come on. Some more system damage ain't gonna hurt us, right? Uh, I gotta love it when your predictions are on point. But yeah, as I mentioned, this was gonna be a short run, so... So we went through Sector 1 and we got a grand total of 65 scrap. That's a pretty bad first sector, right? Welcome, just carrier. <clears throat> welcome, welcome, welcome. You're uh, about nearing the end of the stream because I don't think this run is gonna last for much longer. Uh, sure. Nebula's a great place to actually find stuff. Um, sure, right? We might as well try to make it work. Oh, I didn't really find a store. Well, I really should have healed my crew. Oh well. Okay, so I need you to get from Med Bay. See if you can find a weapon for two. Probably not, right? Oh, repair. Um. Oh, it's Steven. If it wasn't, it was. If it was a Steve, he could have uh, maybe have made something work. But uh, no. So we're in sector two now. Ships should only have one shield bar for now, right? Still. Here's hoping, otherwise we're screwed. Could have repaired more, but... Mm. Alright lads, we've got 25% evasion. It's all gonna work out swimmingly. Well, maybe not. <laughs> How would you do that? Did 
you're supposed to fire a thing on your own ship, not the enemies. I mean, there's like tactical reasons to fire at the enemy, like if you're indeed going for a boarding strategy, but yeah, you know. Of course, drones everywhere. Oh, look, and these uh, still exist. Nope, because you're going to kill another crew member. You know it, I know it, the game knows it. I'm always surprised on how fast missile launchers are. It's like you think for something that pierces shields and everything, it will be like rather slow. Nope. It's just as fast as your usual conventional weaponry. Alright, I'm calling it now. This thing is going to try to run and it's going to succeed at it. I'm too smart for this game. Well, for the enemy it doesn't. Well, it does, but... The enemy don't care, right? If it pops out four missiles at you and then dies, eh, who cares? Next ship will have uh, more missiles for you. Yeah, you got a point. Hey, nobody's forcing you to play it, right? And I think I have gotten a victory with it, so... <clears throat> the problem is indeed, if ships try to run and you don't got anything good, they are likely to succeed at running. The sad truth of it all, I guess. Of course, missing half your shots doesn't help you much either. <sighs> anyway, what do you, uh, you think the odds are that it's going to try and run again? It could still run. We don't have any missiles. Alright, so if you get a storm... Uh oh, we're out of fuel too. <laughs> yes, please. What, it bored me now? Where is he? Sensors. Oh, it's just one dude. Oh, the man still got him. Nice dodge, though. Another blatant lie brought to you by me. Oh, 
Well, there's your problem. Um, he's likely to run, I guess. We're done. Did should probably not do this anymore then. Hey, one hit point wonder, right? That's all you need. swear words for some bizarre reason. Oh, hey, look, another breach. Eh, don't worry about it. Um, can't, it's the wrong <laughs> ship class. Doesn't replace the Kestrel. I wonder if you can get killed by event damage. That's always fun, right? Happened a few times to me now. No store, so yeah, the game is really out to get me. It's taking revenge for the one run that went okay. And if it needs to happen, hey, might as well be on this ship, right? Uh, we'll ignore it, I guess. So, you know, you know, like, ooh, we tried. But eventually we will uh, kick the bucket. Um, I could. Or I could just embrace death and do this instead. Is this the choice that's gonna kill us? Probably. Or maybe not. Again, we're going to the next sector, and that's where ships are going to start having two shield layers, and that's going to become impossible for us to deal with if we don't have anything to go with. So, who's up for rebel diving? Yeah, it's going to be a rebel dive. No matter what I do. Let's hope we find some shields. Uh, not shields. Fuel. Nope, not gonna get any fuel either. Okay, let's go back to the store, buy fuel, and do two rebel dives. We're dead, aren't we? Shouldn't come as a surprise. Yes. Time to die. Woo! On the bright side, no ASB, so that's nice. Yeah, with this ship, no less. Uh, do not know. Indeed it is. So where the mantis can get the oxygen under control. Hmm. Now that we fudged up their weapons up to the point where they probably can't fix them anymore, I think. May as well kill them, right? Yeah, 
Yeah, it doesn't seem like they're gonna get a handle on the weapons anymore. We can lock down, that's all we need to know. Anybody in here? Nope. Alrighty then. Hey, there's always Google, right? So we should be able to just do the same thing on the next one, right? Because it's also in a nebula. Nebula, blah, blah, blah. Too fast, they're following us straight into the rooms. I think he's gonna make it in. No, he doesn't. It doesn't seem like any one of them is going down into the back roads. I think I trapped them all in there. fix that in time. I think this is it, lads. It's been a blast, but uh, this is where we Sign off. Kaboom. <laughs> hey, we survived for a little over half an hour. That's not too bad, right? And those are some really huge gibs. Good lord. All right. That is going to do it for this episode. Then, thank you guys for watching. Hope you still enjoy the series of free shows, probably coming likely. And, or something if you haven't already, I'm seeing you guys on the next episode. Bye, everyone.